Onikodaki is a very important time lock. Why? Because it's the end result of many flowcharts. A flowchart is a possibility tree. If the opponent does this, I will do this. If I do this, the opponent will do this. First thing, a tray. Just make your hand like a tray, like a coffee is here. This hand stays like this all the time. Okay? Do not turn the hand like this when you enter, like this. Why? You create more pressure. What we want is, again, to frame the area of the lock. Okay, so we have a frame, like a picture frame from four sides. Now, please hold. One. From underneath, I come with the hand and clap. This makes sure I have the correct position of the hands. Then I will hold it close to my chest. It's so close that if he takes the hand out and tries to pull back, of course he can, but he feels the pressure. This is how close I want to do it. Why? In all the shoulder locks, I want to control a bent elbow. If I do not control a bent elbow here, and I do not control the elbow that it is bent, what can he do? He can take back. He moves easily here, and in the middle of sparring or tatakai, he takes my back. So I do one, two. Another thing is, when he holds, I come with the hand above the elbow. Why? If he pulls the hand bent like this, this will stop him from popping out of this important arm. So one, two. Did you hear it? I'm closing the possibility of entering. And here I control the elbow. So I bend it. And this is what is called the sneezing position. Why is it called the sneezing position? Because if I sneeze, I break his shoulder. And from here, I can take him to any direction I want. I can do also togake. I can just do the chicken wing and pop his shoulder up. Okay, just here. Or I can do the most, uh, the longest, but the, the, the most devastating route, which is to take his chicken wing, his shoulder, this. And this causes me to take the leg that is far away from the opponent down on the floor. And all of this together makes an imaginary form on the dojo floor. Half a circle in, half a circle out. And again, half a circle taking him down. And he has to rotate and sit. One more time, another direction. So, half a circle in, half a circle out, and make sure that you have a bent elbow control. And then again, you do the half circle and you sit. And he has to turn and sit down. This concludes Onikudaki Armlock points.